Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your weekly reading for the end of June. So this is the 25th through July 1st, or whenever it resonates. This is for the sign of Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, however you want it. We're going to get one of these, we're going to get one of these. If it flips out while I'm shuffling, then you'll get to see it. If not, we'll reveal it at the end. Generally, my readings are love readings. Just take what resonates and leave the rest. This is for the sign of Virgo. Remember, the timing is fluid. Almost flipped it. having a hard time staying together you know the cards did too so something you may some of you may be having a hard time staying together or keeping composure okay that could be a message this is for the sign of Virgo You guys have a major new beginning right in front of you. Something really, really big. Some sort of huge completion is has happened or is about to happen. A big completion in your life, a big phase, okay? A long-term phase is, is ending or it has ended. Wow, I got three of them. It's like the truth has come out. Something has been revealed. Somebody could have gotten caught doing something, whether it's you or another person. Um, yeah, some kind of secret has been revealed, okay? And it feels as though now you may be allowed to follow your own path. You may be able to follow your own path. Um, some sort of acceptance of the reality. You know, I accept it. I see the reality. I accept the reality. You know, I've had some sort of revelation or a secret has been revealed. Something that was quite burdensome anyway. It was really heavy to carry around. I, uh, you know, it could be the end of a contract, the end of a union between two people. This is the lover's reverse. It's the end of a union. The secret has come out. The judgment reversed. The truth has been revealed, Virgo. The truth, the truth has been revealed. Or it's going to be. And it feels as though there's no reconciliation for this. There isn't. There's no way to fix this deception. You know, these. it's no way. There's no way. Somebody has been lying. Somebody has absolutely been lying. Okay, there's been some manipulation here. There's been some conflicts. Um, maybe it's unexpectedly. There's, there could have been an unexpected re revelation, you know, an unexpected truth that came out that has brought about some conflicts, you know, in a relationship, okay? Because the lovers is kind of like a union, a relationship, it is. You know, there's consequences of your choices. So it feels like as though somebody, somebody could have cheated with the Seven of Swords on a relationship. They could have cheated, you know, whatever. And now the truth came out. They got caught. Because the Seven of Swords is I got caught. Seven of Swords reversed. Somebody got caught. Anyway, it feels as though all this is happening because you've evolved anyway. You've evolved. You weren't the same person. You know, things need to change. A phase was needing to end in your life. So, you know, I feel as though um, others, others see you. Others see you as... Carrying around a heavy burden, you know, they see that you're you're probably weighed down that you're overwhelmed You know that you're overwhelmed with the changes that are going on within you with the, with the 
the new you, you know, they, they see that you're overwhelmed. They, they can see that. They can see that you have a heavy weight on your shoulders. It's, it's evident, okay, because this is how other people see you. Um, and it feels, in your advice, this is the advice position, the lover's reverse, is to let this contract end. Let it end. You know, or to keep moving forward away from it, you know, away from this conflict, away from this indecision, away from this contract that isn't meant to be. That's your advice. The outcome is the magician reversed. This is this is deception. This is lies. So there's some sort of lie that has been revealed, whether it's you or the other person that lied. There's some sort of deception. Okay, there is. There absolutely is. Okay. I don't even, I want to make sure that I got this moved in. Now, and this is major, okay? It is, it's major because there's major changes happening for you. It's like you guys are being forced to evolve, okay? Major arcana, major arcana, major arcana, major arcana, major, major, major. So out of these, what? We have four, five, six, seven, eight, ten cards. I never count them. Out of these ten cards, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven majors. Seven majors. Major change. Major change is upon you. And that world card would signify that. You know, you guys are ending a a significant phase in your life, a significant chapter, okay? The challenge is the page of swords reversed, is difficulty in, in communication, unexpected conflict, um, biting off more than you can chew. That's your challenge. Your challenge is is not wanting the conflict when you got to face the truth. And now you're you have to face it. Okay? Around the corner is this faith card, which is the hero font card. This right here around the corner is you guys having faith, having faith in yourselves, um following your own path, believing in yourself, listening to your inner guide, um, becoming more spiritually aware right around the corner, okay? This is um, this is saying, have you been listening? Have you been listening to your inner guide? Okay, that's what the Hierophant says. I have you. Are you listening? You know, I, I, I believe that there, there could be some legal issues right around the corner in regards to a marriage. Okay, there could be a marriage that could be ending, okay, because this is the end of a contract right here. And judgment is a karma card, karma contract, karmic contract, okay. So I feel like there is some sort, and there's a completion, okay. So there's a completion here of a karmic contract because you have evolved, you have done that, you've done that work, you've learned some sort of lesson, you have the world card, you've learned a lesson. And now you're probably overwhelmed with this truth that has come out. The temperance card is about balance, healing, and patience, renewal. That's what's happening, is you guys are going through a renewal. You're not the same person, and I know I've said this before. And you can no longer, you can't lie forever, whether it's you or the other person. The truth eventually comes out. Let's get some clarifiers. Right now, right now in the now position is right up here. Okay, the moon card reverse reality. Reality has struck. It's time to face your fears. It's time to face this conflict. Somebody has been holding on resisting, resisting this change because they didn't want to face their fears. They didn't want the conflict. But is but you're going through a renewal. You have another renewal card. You are. You're going through a renewal. You're going through a new phase that is leading you towards your ultimate wish fulfillment. 
And you can't, you can't stall it forever. You can't. I feel as though somebody is beginning to re realize the truth of what their happily ever after looks like. And although whatever is happening or has happened may have brought conflicts, may have brought some arguments, and may have caused a little bit of upheaval in your life, it is leading you towards healing, renewal, and happiness. You're about, you're about to um, end this difficult period in your life. It's ending. A difficult period in your life is ending. The emperor over here in your challenge position, wanting to keep the family, family structure, wanting to keep things organized, that's a challenge. In your future, Virgo, you have love. You have you do have love in your future. We have the two of cups. After this truth is revealed and it hurts, you find love in the future. True love. Some of you have a connection with somebody that is beautiful. It's a beautiful connection. Ace of Wands reversed. Because there was a lack of passion in this situation that you've been holding on to. You've been holding on to a situation where there was no passion, lying about it. Seriously, there's seriously some lies here. Lying about the lack of passion. And now it's time to do the right thing. It's time for the truth to come out. So I feel like this week the truth is being revealed. Whether you were lying or your partner was lying. It could go either way. Some truth is being revealed that is going to move you forward towards your true love. This could have already happened. And now this true love, this new, this new opportunity, this new union comes into factor. Or, this is happening now. Some sort of finality is coming to your life. Something is, is coming that is going to allow you to step over the finish line and start a new chapter. And it is absolutely karmic. What you went through was karmic. There is absolutely no doubt about it. Now it's time to act with integrity and seek the balance balance and the temperance is balance seek balance bring balance back to your life back to your soul it's a time of hope it's a time of inspiration so through this chaos you will find healing and you will find love let's get another card for this two of cups You're going to find something stable, secure, practical. Genuine. Oh, I got two. You've been involved in an unhappy situation, a very, very, very unhappy situation where there's a lot of negativity surrounding in the energy, negative energy. And it feels as though there is a door closing that is going to allow you to find that love that you are hoping for. So, 
right around the corner is renewed faith right around the corner is letting go struggling through this looking at life from a whole new perspective going on a new journey with faith believing in yourself following your own path is right around the corner And it is going to lead to happiness. It is going to lead to, to contentment. And a new commitment. This is going to happen after the secret is, is revealed. There is a secret that is going to be revealed that is going to change your life for the better. Whether it has happened already or it's going to happen in the near future, it is going to happen. There is absolutely going to be a revelation that changes your life for the better. And whether that's an internal revelation or the truth actually being revealed, somebody getting caught in a lie, that changes everything. But it is going to allow you to take the next step. It is going to allow you to take the next step. It's going to allow you to bring that balance back to your life and to your soul that you've been wanting. It's going to bring you peace. Trust me, it is. It's going to bring you inner peace. I saw that over here with these cards. Allow it to happen. Don't fight it. Deal with the conflict. Struggle through it. Struggle through it with the hangman. You're going to have to struggle through it sooner or later. You might as well do it now. You've been wanting to resist this straight change to keep things organized. Perhaps to protect somebody. But it wasn't doing anything for you. So Virgo, I feel like this is a week where some sort of truth is revealed and it pushes you in a much better direction that is better suited for you. Pride. I love myself and I see myself in everyone. Trust. Faith is right here, right around the corner. Trust. This situation is calling you, calling for you to have faith. Whatever has happened or is happening is meant to happen. Trust the process. Trust the divine plan. Trust your journey. Trust yourself. Believe in yourself. Follow your own path. That's what the, this is what the Hierophant does. Believe in yourself. So anyway, this is what I have, Virgo. I feel as though the truth is about to be revealed. And it's going to be a blessing in disguise. It might hurt for a minute. But it's going to bring you peace, hope, renewal, and healing in the long run. And love. Somebody that you are... You could be a potential soulmate with this new love. With the Two of Cups. Very compatible. So anyway, this is what I have. Talk to you later.